Welcome back to Pilates by Christine. You'll need a small towel for this workout. A kitchen towel or a microfiber cloth works great. Really light session today, working our way around the core. We'll do some coordination work and add in some mobility. Even if you're tired or sore today, this one is really manageable and it's only 20 minutes. To start, let's fold that towel into a small square, just big enough to place under one of your hands. You can set the towel to the side to start, walk the hands out to all fours for cat and cow warm up. Inhale, tuck the tailbone, draw the belly button in, arch the spine, relax the head towards the floor, Exhale, reverse, looking up to the ceiling. Inhale, up into cat. Exhale, release to cow. Rolling through the spine. Moving from the tailbone, through the back, shoulders, all the way up to the top of the head. Warm up the back, smoother with each repetition. One more set, inhale up to cat. Exhale, release to cow. Find your neutral spine. Take a baby step forward with each hand creating space for an elbow fold down to the mat and lift. Simple arm warm up. Fold down, tap the elbows, press back up, back stays flat. Palms connected to the mat. Hips over the knees. Two more. Lower down, press up. Walk the hands back, try the next level. Bending halfway down, press up. Start to feel it in the triceps. Point the elbows straight back, halfway down, halfway up. Flat back. Three more times. Down, lift, two, press up and halfway down, halfway up. You can get your towel, place it under one hand and the opposite foot goes out behind you. Start with just the hand, slide forward, slide back, slide forward and back. Lightly across the floor, let's add a kick and a tuck as you slide. You can pick which direction the arm goes with the leg, whatever happens naturally, stick with it sliding and tucking, sliding and kicking. Start slow if you need to. Using the abs to stabilize so we can move the arm and opposite leg together. Last time. Lower the foot down, switch sides other hand, start with just the hand forward and back, lightly sliding on the floor, then add the opposite leg kick, tuck and slide, add the kick. Keep 
the chin lifted. Hips and shoulders are in line. Three more times. Slide forward and back. Two. One. Lower the foot down. Place the towel to the side again and drop to the elbows. One foot kicks up. Straight line down from the ankle through the hip to the shoulders. Tuck the knee around to the side and kick back up. Tuck and kick. Keeping your neutral spine well supported on the forearms. Warming up those glutes. Three more. Two. One. Kick up straight, tap the toe down, tuck the knee in, back to the hands, press up to down dog, lift the hips, press the heels into the mat, stretch the shoulders, hold it here 30 seconds. Ease into your stretch. Feel the shoulders loosen, pressing back. Slowly lift the heels off the mat, drop to the knees, return to the elbows. Other foot kicks out and up. Knee tuck side, kick straight up. Knee tucks and kicks. You'll feel it working both glutes, the supporting side, and the leg that's moving. Keep pressing into the forearms so the shoulders stay over the elbows. Last time kicking with the tuck. Raise it back up. Toe taps down, bring the knee in. Towel under the hand again, opposite foot out, back to a little coordination work. Slide the towel forward with the leg lift and a little elbow bend so you can reach forward. Exhale, press up and pull everything in. Leg up, towel slides forward, press up. We did that arm warm up. You can see it's coming back right here. Little tricep work with your coordination. Flat back, deep stabilizing abdominals, all helping you out right here. Reach, slide back, light tap. One more on this side, slide out, slide back and tap. Switch to the other side, towel under the hand, opposite foot out. You can lift the leg to start or just go right into it, sliding and kicking. Supporting elbow bent, press it back up. Lengthen out, lift back. It's like a teeter-totter with the body. Even line from the ankle through the hip, through the shoulder.
three more. Keep it slow. Two. Reach it out once more. Pull through the center to lift back up. Sit back, hips to heels. Let's unfold the towel and roll it up on the long end. Then to a kneeling setup, one foot out to the side, lift the towel overhead. Start by folding one arm across to the front knee. Lift back, arms slightly wider than shoulder width apart. A good T-spine thoracic rotation here. Trying to keep the shoulders relaxed. On the next fold, pause right here, then swing back, straightening the front leg. Swing out to the diagonal, unfold. That's your combo. Fold across, swing back, swing up, unfold. Teaching our abs to move with good rotation of the T spine, the thoracic spine. Also getting in some hip mobility. Watch that the front knee doesn't go over the toe. Last one. Then you might wanna pull in that bottom knee so it's a straight line from the shoulder, the hip to the knee. Side tilt. Here's more obliques work. Exhale, lift up. One circle towards the straight leg, around and up. Then side bend. Exhale, lift to stack. Circle around, lift and repeat, that's your combo. As you side bend, think of lifting out of that hip, feeling a little inner thigh stretch with it, circling around for fun, side bend, exhale lift, Circle forward, two more times this side. Once more, side bend, exhale lift, inhale circle around. Let's switch sides. Angle one foot out, reach overhead, fold across towards the front leg, and open. Work with this movement for a few repetitions. Can you fold without that knee moving, isolating the rib cage movement, not just the arm? but the whole rib cage follows. Let's pause so we can add the swing back, reach, unfold, repeat, fold across, swing back, rotate as you reach across, unfold, and repeat. It's a gentle movement meant to teach us good rotation, healthy movement patterns. This means we can effectively and functionally strengthen our muscles to work for us. 
knowing how to move comes first and then strengthening comes second. Last time, fold, swing back and stretch, rotate back, unfold, lower down the hands, readjust the legs if you need to, shoulder over hip over knee, side bend, lifting into the big stretch, circle around, up and over, Exhale, lift back, circle front. Arms strong, shoulders relaxed. This one's the hardest move of the day. You'll feel it. You really bend over. Two more. Side bend. Exhale, lift. Circle forward. Last one's the best one. Side bend over. Exhale to lift. Circle. And pause overhead. Lower the hands down. Keep your towel rolled up. and place it in front of the mat. We're gonna take a plank, just holding your plank 30 seconds here. We're working up to that full plank. Knees are always an option. We just finished a good oblique set. We're back to those stabilizing abs. That's our ab work today, is all that stabilizing work, plus our rotation work we just did. Lower your whole body down to the mat. Grab the towel, place the hands on top of it, and we're going to do a swan slide. So I lift the upper back, Slide the hands towards me, getting the assistance of the towel on the floor. Slowly lower and exhale, lift, slide up. Inhale, reach away, lengthen to lower down. You get some help by pressing the hands into the floor. This is a back exercise. So you want to use those muscles right behind the shoulder blades, pulling the shoulder blades down the rib cage to lift, releasing into a stretch. Two more times. One more, exhale to lift, inhale, release. Keep the towel where it is, grip the outside edges, lift both feet up, both hands up. You can split the legs out to the side, rowing the towel in, squeeze the legs together, press it away. Row in and split, squeeze and press. Row in, little extra lift as you row in. Inner thigh work to squeeze those legs together as you press. Exhale up, inhale, reach. Trying to keep the hands off the floor the whole time. Almost there. Last one, right here, row it up, squeeze and stretch, 
flutter kick. Hold it right here. Just flutter kick for me 20 seconds. You got it. Keep those hands off the floor. Shoulders strong. Back is working. Stay lifted, baby flutter kicks. You got it. Five more seconds. Three, two, one. Pause and lower with control back to the mat. There you go. That was your 20 minutes. We got all the way around the core. Let's press back into one stretch. Child's pose, hips to heels, relax the head, stretch the arms out. Good job being here and getting this quick workout in. Every movement session matters. I hope you feel restored and refreshed after this workout. Let me know how it went. I'll see you again tomorrow.